Welcome to Grayon Ma. We are given three squares and two squares are arranged side by side and their combined length is 10 and another green square is has its two points or vertices that is coinciding with the midpoints of the two first two squares the blue and the yellow square uh, we are to find the area of the triangle okay so we attack this problem by first we label the sides of the figure so let us label the side of this blue square as 2a and of course this other is 2a and since this distance so some of the distances of the two squares the total is 10 then this length should be 10 minus 2a and this distance which is half of the blue square this should be a and this distance should be 2a minus 2a minus 10 minus 2a and that would be 4a minus 10 and this distance is actually this green the side of the green i mean is actually half of the sides of the two squares so if you combine that then that would be 5 or 10 over 2 is equal to 5 this is 5 okay so next thing that we need to do is we need to subdivide the triangle into three smaller triangles then this first triangle should be this one and next is this one we need to draw a line from this point into the yellow square and we need to connect this point to the this point and this is the next triangle and this is the next triangle this one so three triangles we divided this larger triangle okay so next thing is i have already labeled this bigger triangle and subdivided each part and label it as a b and c and since we divided it into three parts then the area is equal to the sum of these three parts so it is area is equal to one half times for the area of the a we have the base this could be the base as 4a minus 10 times the height which is this portion this is actually half of the larger square the blue square so that would be half of 2a is actually a then we need to add this triangle B. The triangle B has a base of 10 minus 2A. 10 minus 2A. 1 half times 10 minus 2A. Multiplied by the height which is this length. Up to the bottom of the green square. And this is actually 10 minus 2A plus 5. So that would be 10 minus 2A plus 5 then we need to add the last triangle 1 half times the base which is actually 10 minus 2a okay insufficient space just write it we'll just write it here 4a minus 10 okay okay so next is we factor out the 
sum of the terms is equal to one half times two times four a can is written as two a minus five times a plus one half times two times five minus a and we can simply add this 15 minus 2a plus this is actually one half times 2 times 5 minus a sorry 5 minus a times 4a minus 10 Next is we cancel this out, this 2. So we have 2a minus 5 times a plus 5 minus a times 15 minus 2a plus 5 minus a times 4a minus 10 next if we factor out this 5 minus a for the third and for the second and the third term we have 5 minus a times 15 minus 2a plus 4a minus 10 then we have 2a minus 5 times a plus okay so next is we simplify this this becomes area is equal to negative i mean positive 2a square minus 5a plus 5 minus a and we simplify this inside of this bracket then we have 15 minus 10 is 5 then we have positive 2a then if we simplify further we just need to copy this 2a square minus 5a plus 25 the outside the first and the first then the insides so we have negative 5a then the outside terms we have plus 10 a then the second and the second of the both the mult the we need to multiply we have negative 2a square and we can cancel this 2a square positive and negative in this 10a and if you add this with the 2 negative 5a and the 10a cancels out then we have area is equal to 25 square units and that is our answer thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this thank you bye